Hey, good morning from the uh, church office. This is a little seed for your heart. Boy, I tell you what, it's great. It falls coming, but I got my uh, summer shirt on because I don't want summer to leave. But then again, God has it all in control. He knows the seasons, the times. He knows you and me. I love this verse in Psalm 116. A couple of verses here in verse 1. It says, I love the Lord because he has heard my voice and my supplications because he has inclined his ear to me. Therefore, I will call upon him as long as I live. Call upon the Lord. I will call upon the Lord who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from my enemies. The Lord liveth. Blessed be the rock. And may the God of my salvation be exalted. The Lord liveth. Blessed be the rock, and may the God of my salvation be exalted. Hey, I just got hearing aids. I could hear good. <laughs> I'm 71 years old. I hesitated in getting these hearing aids, but people in the church begged me because the music was so loud. They had to hide under the seats. And now I could hear every breath, every crack. I put them on. I was driving my car. I heard creaks and cracks I never heard before. But, uh, you know, with old age, God provides. I, I just thank God that I can get them, you know. A lot of people can't. I can't think of people that are dealing with all kinds of issues that are destitute today, you know, on the street or, or just been through hard times. So I have to thank God for my substance and how God provides for me, you know, and uh, do my best to make ease the suffering of other people. But that's my supplication today, that you are rooted and grounded in Him and as the seasons start to change, that you just uh, dig in deep with the Lord because winter's coming in many ways. So you hide yourself in the cleft of the rock and God lift up your prayer needs to the Lord. Lord, I just pray for everybody today. Just as your word says, we uh, lift up our supplications. We put you first and we thank you that you answer prayers, uh, whether we're suffering or whether we're going through a high and mighty time. But... Uh, you're there through it all. Help us to trust you and not in uh, chariots and horses, people, places, and things, but to trust you in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a great day. We'll see you next week. Stay close to the Lord.